Welcome to my YouTube channel, Big Ideas Simplified. Today, we will be talking about lithium. If you like my video and learn something new, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel below. Leave me a comment if you have a question, and I will respond as soon as I can. Did you know that there are 118 elements in the periodic table? Among all of the fascinating elements that exist in the world, my favorite is lithium, which comes from the ancient Greek word lithos, meaning stone. So, let's talk about... Lithium Introduction Lithium symbol is Li. Its atomic number is 3, which is the number of protons and electrons it has. Protons are positively charged particles, and electrons are negatively charged particles. Protons are in the nucleus, which is the center of an atom, and electrons circle around the nucleus. Lithium's atomic mass is 6.94, which is the total number of protons and neutrons in its nucleus. Neutrons are neutrally charged particles. Lithium's ion charge is 1 plus, meaning when lithium becomes an ion, it releases one electron, becoming positively charged by one proton. Discovery Lithium was discovered in 1817 by a man named Johann August Arfwedson when he was investigating a petalite ore, which was one of the first lithium minerals to be discovered. When in a fire, it had a deep red color. Arfwedson analyzed it and concluded it contained a new metal, which he named lithium. Physical and Chemical Properties Lithium has a melting point of 180.5 degrees Celsius and a boiling point of 1,342 degrees Celsius. Its density is 0 0.534 grams per cubic centimeter, which is the lowest of all metals. At room temperature, lithium is a solid. Its color is a shiny silvery white. It has a smooth texture, is soft, and has no odor. Periodic Table Location As I said before, lithium's atomic number is 3, which means it is the third element in the periodic table. It is in group 1, which is the alkali metals, and is in period 2. Atomic Features Lithium only has 3 protons, so it has a very low density. It usually has four neutrons, but it rarely has three. To become an ion, lithium gives away one electron, which gives it a plus one atomic charge. Element Location When the Big Bang happened, a large amount of lithium was spread across the galaxy. While it doesn't occur as the metal in nature, it is found combined in small amounts in nearly all igneous rocks and in the waters of many metal springs. Spodumene, petalite, lepidolite, and amblygonite are all important minerals that contain lithium. You can also find trace amounts in plants, plankton, and invertebrates, which are animals without backbones. Today, Australia, Chile, and China mine around 80% of the world's lithium. Pure or compound, lithium is so reactive, it cannot be found in its pure form, because moist air corrodes it quickly. What kinds of compounds can lithium form? Lithium can form lithium carbonate, lithium hydroxide, lithium oxide, lithium chloride, lithium acetate, and lithium carbide. Applications how was lithium used in the past? In 1949, Australian psychiatrist John Cade used lithium to treat mania and depression, which became popular in Europe and the USA. The first major application of lithium 
was in high temperature grease for plane engines, like during World War II. The demand of lithium rose during the Cold War because lithium was being used to produce nuclear fusion weapons. Finally, in 2007, the development of lithium ion batteries became the dominant use of lithium. Now, how is lithium used today? Lithium is a good conductor of heat and electricity. Lithium is also used in rechargeable batteries for phones, laptops, digital cameras, and electric vehicles. It is also used in some non-rechargeable batteries for things like heart pacemakers, toys, and clocks. Aluminum lithium metals are used in aircraft, bicycle frames, and high-speed trains. Lithium oxide is used in special glasses and glass ceramics. Lithium chloride is used in air conditioning. Lithium carbonate is used in drugs to treat manic depression. Lastly, lithium hydride is used to store hydrogen for fuel. What is the economic importance of lithium in Canada or elsewhere in the world? The government of Canada has identified lithium as an important element because it is a key focus in the renewable energy transition. Canada could be a supplier to other countries, positively contributing to our economy. It is argued that lithium will be one of the main objects of geopolitical competition in a future world running on renewable energy and dependent on batteries. One interesting fact about lithium is that while it is a metal, it is so soft that it can be cut by a kitchen knife and it is light enough to float on water. Thanks for watching! Stay tuned for more big ideas, simplified content!